My name is Cody Shane, it's Cody Shit, and you're watching Max Series. This shit is fire, white cheddar. I fuck with it. I like it. It's 100% whole grain. I mean, I'm pretty sure everybody knows what this is. The chip selection was pretty ass at the store, definitely. So I went with these. Fire. This is my movie date right here. Go to the movies with these right here. They only got this in New York, so every time I come to New York, whenever I see it, I gotta buy it. So fire. Cream soda, Dr. Brown. Can't find this everywhere in Atlanta either. They didn't have Pineapple Fanta, but usually I get the Pineapple Fanta with the cream soda and I mix it. But this time, I did the Sun Kiss. One time, I had a soda. I had two sodas, but I only had a little bit left. So I just mixed it when I was in LA one time and it tastes so great and I was like, this is my thing. Got to copyright it. I don't really like breakfast, but I was like doing the pescatarian thing okay. for like a year and a half. And then I started eating chicken. I, I messed it up. I gave in, I started eating chicken. Chicken nuggets from Chick-fil-A. I had one and I was like, this is so, what? It, what? it was like the first time I ever had chicken ever in my life, and I was like, well, what have I been missing? And I went to Chick-fil-A and OD'd it. But 2019, I'm back on that diet. Right now, I'm just binging out. I don't even know, but one thing Atlanta has that New York doesn't really have is like wings. Like, I can't ever find no good wings in New York. Atlanta got the wings. Jarrah Creek is his five. That's just somewhere that they don't have out here. The Chick-fil-A in Atlanta is way better than any other Chick-fil-A, just because I don't know why. I just had some ice cream earlier from Chick-fil-A and it wasn't that far. It's better in Atlanta. Man, I'm searching for restaurants all day, every day. I, I got a few restaurants I like in LA and stuff, but New York is hard for me to find stuff I really like. Something greasy. When I used to be back in the day, which I shouldn't even be saying back in the day, but probably bacon, like bacon and like some pancakes. <laughs> so good sometimes with a glass of milk. Stop it. If I have one meal left to eat, I need one of them hundred dollar steaks. A fat steak, like a 20 ounce. I need that 20 ounce steak, you dig? Mashed potatoes. I need like mad stuff. I need mac and cheese, baked mac and cheese for my mom. My mom got to fly out and cook the mac and cheese. I need asparagus. I need greens. I need cornbread. I need a Hawaiian roll, like I need everything. I need salmon, I need some shrimp laid on top of that steak. I need my steak to be Oscar. We can put the shrimp on top of the salmon. Mm -hmm, I need all that. And I need a little bitty little, like a, a homemade Alfredo, cause you know, home, homemade Alfredo is so good. If this is the last time I can eat, and then I need garlic bread on that too. It's one big meal. No disrespect, but these dumpling things, and it was like a dumpling taco. You ever seen those? It was like the outside is a dumpling, and then it's like, it's like an Asian thing. Oh my God, it was the worst thing I've ever had. It was the worst thing. 
The inside of it was straight, but the dumpling was like, I went to Ruth Chris like t a week ago before I got to New York, spent like $200. But usually when I go out on big meal, big dinners, I don't pay. I don't even know what it is. Everything I like is already created. <laughs> what would I make on snack? Yeah, I'll make, I'll make pineapple cream soda probably. That'd be so good.